So the word repetiteur comes from the French verb répéter, which literally means to repeat or to rehearse. What we do is we, we take the place of the orchestra in the rehearsal rooms. We know exactly what instruments are playing, what lines, and we can sort of play it differently on the keyboard depending on whether it's strings or woodwinds or brass. We follow the conductor and uh, respond to whatever he or she is doing just as the orchestra would. For example, a string section would have a little bit more pedal. The strings would have a little more cushion to the sound so you could blur it together a little bit more. Whereas uh, if you had clarinets and flutes in the higher register, I would probably play with a little bit less pedal and, and articulate it a bit more with a little more clarity. Yeah, just sort of imagining the tone those instruments would have. If you have brass, of course, you can really dig into the keys. I usually just think of that as, as happening in my head and, and, and just coming out, you know, through, through the way that I play it um, on the keyboard, yeah.